Hi guys, Marks here, Pipers and Guns, coming to you this Monday afternoon with some uh, chit chat, smoking my uh, busted GL with some uh, the last of my Capstan Blue. I had my first ever tin, and it's quite nice. And I really like this pipe from time to time. You know, it's a pretty petite pipe. But it's really lovely to smoke Virginia's from. Out of periques or, or vapors. Anyway. I have a little subject today and it's uh, regarding upload speed when uploading videos to YouTube because I, I heard a lot of people having issues the last couple of days like the last week myself haven't had any upload issues that videos have not been able to upload but I don't really know how you guys upload I usually edit my videos in iMovie I use my my iPhone to record pretty much and I edit uh, the clip on my iPhone in the free iMovie software that you can download so I have an iPhone 8 and um, anyways I usually upload video through iMovies because you can choose to share the video to your YouTube account through iMovies so it's pretty simple and I've noticed when you try to upload videos from the YouTube app on your mobile device and from iOS anyways that it pretty easy get paused you know if if your screen goes black or whatnot or it feels like that anyways because every time you go in again or unlock your phone it like reprocesses how many you know percentage it has done or how many minutes are left for upload or whatever and it feels like it like it pauses there and then when you unlock your screen it continues but it might be uh, just an illusion but you guys could comment down in the bucket uh, you know if you have any input on that so I'm gonna do a little test because normally a 10 minute clip takes about 30 minutes for me to process and upload because in iMovies when you when you made your video clip and you edit it and also and then it needs to save it and then it will upload it so it does this in the same flow so or same process to say you don't need to push any buttons in between you just press upload you select your 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 name on your video any you know other subjects or text in the in the bucket um, you know your resolution and all that crap and then it just does it and you can just put it on charge or whatever and it, it, it will uh, you know complete the upload and then usually it's never a problem usually like normally it, it, no th nothing goes wrong but for me I think you know 30 minutes for a 10 minute video it's a long time uh, I have a fiber internet connection or uh, you know I have a fiber modem so I have an opti optical cable going straight into my house and my internet provider that I had is a 100 megabit download 10 megabit upload this is like 319 Swedish a month so about let's say 30 US bucks 30 US dollars for a month uh, for a hundred slash ten line now I got a deal from another provider which I already have my 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 TV through so I have uh, like a TV connection or uh, my my all my you know instead of having a satellite dish I, I go through the fiber so I have a little uh, you know box as you normally have at your TV and uh, it connects through the internet instead so through them I got a good 
great deal for a 250 download and a 100 megabit upload line for like 24 bucks a month which is a good good deal i could get a you know gigabit down and gigabit up if i want but it's it's pricey so it's like why so the only thing i want to test out now is when i have this 250 100 line is is it quicker to upload is those you know 10 minute videos gonna take you know you know 15 minutes to upload or whatnot because i'm pretty sure that youtube has a, like a bandwidth you know it will uh, narrow your bandwidth so you cannot upload in at whatever speed you want you know if you have a 100 megabit line up uh, ideal you could upload in 100 megabit because if you have the fiber connection you will always have 100 megabit it's only you know the the bandwidth of the line on the other side that will uh, will be the break so to speak anyway so i'm not sure but i would guess that youtube has a, like a like a bandwidth limiter you know per user or you know when you upload so it doesn't crash their you know their system or whatnot i don't know what the limit is but it would be nice to do a test so i will keep this um video for uh 10 minutes long and then i will time when i start to upload uh, or i would from the time i start processing the video saving it and until it's uploaded because i don't know when it starts to upload so it's a bit iffy when you do it through through uh, imovies but it will be a good test anyways the boring part is that my last day with my old you know old provider was friday <laughs> so i should have a 250 100 line right now but i don't so i called my new provider this weekend and they said there's all already um like a provider that signed up for me so so they cannot put on my new things on my line so to speak so i had to you know message my old provider and tell them to hey deactivate my account you know remove me from me from from your list or whatever so the my new provider can add me instead and they came back today earlier today and said oh it's done i came back home i restarted my fiber modem uh, nothing happened no difference i could still browse the internet through uh, my Wi-Fi that's connected or my other router that's connected to the fiber box so I still have a, a provider but it's not my new provider so I had to message them again uh, or talk to my new provider they couldn't add it again they get an error message that it's already a subscription or someone else you know providing with me with my internet service so then messaged the other one again uh, which says that no it's nothing there and i said have you checked all the different i could could go in myself in like a portal where i can order different you know providers uh, tv services and whatnot you know ip phone if i want you know i can go into a portal however the the administrators of this portal somehow divided into two different portals so it could be a problem with that i have a provider in one portal but not in the other and my old provider just checked one so we'll see i will know more tomorrow morning i will do a try this evening to see if i can you know enter that portal and check for myself what it says so we're getting close to 10 minutes The timing, whoop, I will write it in the bucket when the video is done. So um, you guys will see my upload speed and please comment if you have any input on this subject because I, I, I know a lot of people that make long videos that are pretty freaking irritated, especially, especially if you do it on your phone and then your phone is busy because you're uploading a video you can't do anything else on it so 
doing lives that's you know no issue because it's done straight off but 10 minutes has passed and i will pause it now or stop it and take care guys have a nice evening don't do anything stupid happy smokes bye bye